So we're here in County Wexford now with Kevin O'Hanlon. Um, we're in a field that was sown in May 2020 of the DLF six species herbal lay, and we still have a, a really good cover of plantain, chicory, red and white clover, everything that we that we sowed back in 2020. And um, this particular paddock is four weeks since its last grazing, and it's probably due its next one now as well. And uh, there's a lot of multi-species, a lot of our six species herbal lay has been sown around the country this year in 2021 and um, a lot of it is probably ready for its, its first grazing now so I just want to do a little quick recap on, on the principles of sowing multi-species and uh, how, we get them, how we get them to establish as best we can. So when, when sowing, I suppose the, the soil preparation seedbed prep is, is pretty much similar to your ryegrass sward, we want a, a firm fine seedbed. Um, we, sowing rate in terms of our multi-species, we want to sow it at at least 14 kilos, around 14 kilos, maybe 15, you can go higher if you want, but the more, the more we sow at the start, the better for better in terms of weed suppression and also the better in terms of persistence. If we start with more chicory and plantain, we'll have more chicory and plantain in, in two or three years time in the sward. Um, fertilizer then is a, a common question that we get asked. Um, probably doesn't need much nitrogen or any nitrogen at all at sowing when the seed is going into the ground. What's important there is P and K, so we need P, uh, phosphorus and potassium to get our, our roots established and to get the, get the seedlings uh, to get their best, their best start possible. Um, maybe then, maybe four to six weeks after sowing, if we think that the, the if, if, every, if everything that we've sown is established well, we've got a good mix of herbs and clovers, and um, we can maybe go in with a little top dressing of nitrogen, maybe a bag, a bag and a half of 10, 10, 20 to the acre. Seems to be, seems to be what guys are going with and it seems to really help kick on the, the new sward. And then a couple of weeks after that, it, it should be fit for grazing. So we normally say to wait about eight weeks, give, give eight weeks after sowing before we go in for our first grazing. This will give our, our legumes and our herbs, especially the chicory, I think, uh, the, uh, the chance to develop a good strong, a good strong root and to be ready for, for its first grazing. A good, um, a good mark of whether our, our new multi-species ward is ready to be grazed and um, again I said eight weeks uh, but also the the chicory should have about six six leaves on it at, at that stage six to eight leaves if we're looking for on a chicory before we give it the first grazing and um, then a light grazing to to clear off the sward I suppose is is, is suitable for for the first grazing and then after that we should see it coming back really really strong for for the second grazing especially in the middle of summer like it is now and where we've got good dry weather so these multi-species wards should should really be be thriving in these conditions